Ladies and gentlemen, today is the day. We finally have an update after months of waiting on the ports for Ultimate Custom Night and Fruity Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. I cannot express how exciting this news is. If you've been waiting for news on the final ports for all seven of the FNAF games, today's your lucky day. To this day, I still get comments asking if there's any news on the rest of the FNAF ports, and today, thankfully, we finally have some. So thanks so much for clicking on the video, subscribe if you're new, smash the like button, and let's hop into the news. It's been so long, I can't even remember the last time we had news on the Ultimate Custom Night port. But if you don't know, the UCN port for consoles is the only port left. As well as Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Sim on the PlayStation, but um, we'll get to that shortly. But UCN is the big news here. So Click Team finally put out a tweet saying, February 15th, 2021, UCN Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Sim update. Ultimate Custom Night is ready for Switch and Xbox One. We are in the middle of the submission process with Sony and specifically ratings with one of the rating agencies to complete the submission process. We hope to have a single release date for all three soon. Concerning Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Sim on PS4, we have the ratings info we were waiting on and we are making our final submission. Cross your animatronic fingers, sincerely click team. I love that not only did we get an update on where we are in the submission process with these games, but also just how transparent they were. Click Team, thank you so much for being so honest. I think they realized that we have been waiting quite a long time for the final ports because they said they would all be released by September of last year, but of course that didn't turn out to be the case. So I'm really happy that they got on here and explained why it's kind of been taking so long. They have done that in the past, uh, especially with PS4 and Sony. I don't know why it's always Sony, but this is, my, my God, this is so amazing. We've been waiting so, so, so long. Again, they said that they were all gonna be out by September of last year, and I'm just so happy that we finally have it. Or at least we're going to have it soon. Because they do say, soon. <laughs> Guys, it's finally happening. Also, I don't want to leak, but I may have gotten a DM from a specific Twitter account. I'm so, so happy. Unbelievably happy. Of course, you all know I'm going to be playing UCN on Switch. I'm going to be trying to beat 50-20 mode. We've got a whole challenge set up for us beating it on stream. It's going to be amazing. And I'm so happy. So I'm gonna end the video off by talking about a few quick things about the Ultimate Custom Night port, specifically prices, platforms, and controls. Now, don't be surprised that UCN is going to cost money on consoles. It costs money on mobile, and we already know that it is going to be uh, the same price as all the other FNAF games on consoles. I mean, they have been working their butts off to get this ported for us. So clearly they need to get paid for their work. And like I said, it's gonna be on consoles, it's gonna be on Switch, Xbox One, and PS4. I'm sure there's like, you know, compatibility so it'll work on like the PS5 and stuff like that. And just to give you guys a perspective on how long we've been waiting for UCN port news, they posted controls for the game on May 6th of 2020. They tweeted out the controls for that time. I don't know if the controls have changed since then, but as far as we're aware, these are the controls for the port. As you can see, they have PS4, they have Switch, and they have Xbox One. I'm gonna be straight up, I doubt um, the Switch is gonna be touchscreen. <laughs> Just saying, I think there's too many controls for that. But yeah, you can see they have a diagram of the map. They have a diagram for the controllers for, again, PS5, Switch, and Xbox. And they also have the, um, oh God, what are they called? The systems that you can switch between, you know, like the power gen, silent ven ventilation, heater, power AC, uh, glow music box, and all off. Not gonna lie, uh, the controls are looking pretty good. Right, you have buttons for the mask, the monitor, press on the joystick to turn everything off. On the D-pad, you have the door controls. On the shapes and letters buttons, you have the catch fish, close add, wind the music box, flashlight, cancel, change music. You got the desk fan for the other joystick. Looks like you have the bumpers or trigger goes for power AC, cool music box, power gen, all that stuff. And then you use your cursor and some buttons to move around the cameras. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. Again, I'm very excited. I don't know if I'll make a video uh, when they reveal the release date, if they show off gameplay, like what they did with the Pizza Sim one, maybe I'll do that. But if it's just a, 
this is the release date, then I'll probably just have like a pinned comment and a community post. But if they do like a trailer showing off gameplay, and then at the very end there's a jump scare with the release date, I'll, I, I may make a video on that, because then we can go through some of the gameplay as they play through it uh, for the trailer. And again, overall, I'm just really excited. <laughs> We've been waiting so long for this, um, and soon all the FNAF ports are going to be done. And then all we have left to wait for is Help Wanted. By the way, they're not doing FNAF World. I, I don't know why people still think they're going to do FNAF World. They're not. They've said this so many times. Click Team has said it. Uh, Scott has said it. It's just, they're not doing it, okay? I'm sad about it. Don't get me wrong. Um, but, you know, there's nothing we can do. It's up to them, so that sucks. But yeah, that is the news again. So excited. I know I keep saying it, but legitimately, we've been waiting for this for so, so long. Click Team, thank you so much. Alright, uh, and thank you for watching the video, and smashing the like, and subscribing if you're new. If you made it to the end of the video, comment, uh, door frame. Why not? Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Uh, goodbye.